How's it going guys, the K Lethal here, welcome back to the channel or welcome to the channel for the very first time I appreciate you, whichever it may be Today we've coming at you with another horror game, it's called No Snake Hotel Never played it before, don't know what it is But apparently there's a 99.99% chance of no snakes at this hotel Now let's see if they're lying or not Welcome to the No Snake Hotel only hotel with a 99.99% no snake guarantee. Here at the No Snake Hotel, we pride ourselves in our incomprehensible lack of snakes. At other hotels, you run the constant risk of finding a snake in your bed sheets, a snake in your toilet, or even waking up to a snake sliding down your throat. It happens more than you'd think. Call the front desk for questions and enjoy your stay at the No Snake Hotel. All right, so we start in an elevator with posters about snakes. Look, 99.99% guaranteed, no snakes. But we don't get a refund if snake is seen, doing us dirty. A little elevator music. Number one, off the bat, the graphics are nice. Um, I just arrived at the hotel. Good golly, Bart. Bro, who talks like that? Um, so, good golly, Bart. This place is immaculate. You know how much I hate snakes, so I went out of my way to stay at the No Snake Hotel. They've really done it, Bart. There are absolutely no snakes in this hotel. I love how this is set in a world where you just find snakes in hotels. Well, what is this in Australia? The elevator music's loud. Alright, so if we see one, we just gotta step on it. Cool. No one's at the main desk. Find room 100. Okay. Alright, so we can't go in 124. 122. The light's not even on. I mean, we're a long way from 100 if they're just going down one by one. I'm used to the door numbers going down two by two on, on you know, on, on the same side. I'm living the dream. I didn't think it was possible, but I sure am happy it is. The No Snake Hotel really lives up to its name. I think I just heard a hiss. What was that? Ever since I was a little girl and got abducted by an army of rabid snakes while on vacation, I haven't left my house. After 50 years in solitude, I finally have a safe place where I can vacation. Thanks, No Snake Hotel. Oh my god, I see. Wait, what was that? Bro, I could have sworn when I was on this page, like to the right there, the blurred edge, I thought that was a snake. I'm tripping. I'm already tripping. Is that where a light switch used to be or like a thermometer maybe? But this game looks very impressive, man. I couldn't laugh when reading that. What's in here? All right. I don't know what this game is about, man. Apparently it's a horror game. I mean, oh, that's Okay. Apparently it's a horror game, I'm assuming we're going to get attacked by snakes, but, you know, everywhere except here. Apparently they're not meant to be here, so let's see. I feel safer than ever here, one time at some other hotel. That's definitely a hiss. I walked into my room and when I turned around to shut the door, there was a snake as long as my arm dangling from the coat hook. That would scare the fuck out of me too. But here at the No Snake Hotel, I don't need to worry about what creepy, slivering creatures might be standing behind me. I'm scared to turn around now, that was a rather deliberate choice of words. Look at the wrinkles in the couch, by the way. These graphics are nice. I'm not gonna lie, I by no means have a snake phobia. But they're not exactly nice to look at. So I don't really want to see one. Well, it's getting loud in here. Alright, room 100. It's like the biggest one. It's the only one with no number. Alright, guys, here we go. Is that blood? What the fuck? Oh my god, there's a snake right there. They did lie to me. I know I, know I wasn't tripping that time. That was definitely a snake, right? Oh my god, it's pitch black. So the point zero what? Oh shit! Run! Oh my god! Sorry, 
Snack. Really? All the way back to the start? I want to see if that's avoidable. What the fuck? All right, I want to see if if it's avoidable, because if that's the entire game, then I don't know if I'm gonna post that. Is there a way I can run from it? It's a bit annoying, it put me back all the way to the start. Yep, look at that snake. Look at that little colourful little bitch. Okay, so there, there is like a hallway down there, it's just pitch black. So I'm gonna run that way. FUCK! RUN! Oh yes, it was avoidable! RUN! FUCKING HELL! WHAT DO YOU MEAN OUT OF ORDER?! Ah! Not only have they lied and there is a fucking snake, it's not just a snake, it's the biggest, scariest, fastest snake you will ever see. It's essentially a basilisk. Um, so, where do I go? Because that was out of order. I don't exactly have time to check where to run either. Because, you know, there's a 100 foot fucking snake behind me. There's got to be somewhere else to go. Is that just a full game? Alright guys, if that isn't the full game, I don't know what to do. That was the No Snake Hotel. This may be as part of like a two game episode because that was really short. It was pretty cool. But yes, that was just No, no Snake Hotel. And it's it, scary being chased by a giant fucking snake, let me tell you that much. Alright guys, welcome to a new horror game. Death Stains. I really should do more research on these games as I'm downloading them before I record, but I'm, I didn't and I don't know what this is about to be, but I like going in blind anyway and not knowing what to expect. I don't know what Death Stains are and I don't necessarily want to find out, but we're gonna find out. Thank you for joining me as always. Give the video a like if you do enjoy, subscribe, all that good stuff, drop a comment, helps with the algorithm, it will help push my channel to new people and help me grow, alright? Much love everyone, and uh, let's find out what death stains are, and probably become a death stain, or have death stains on us. It, it is a little alarming that they're white stains, um, but anyway, let's go, let's just get into this man, enough bullshit. Alright, so it just drops us in um, some sort of cabin, in the woods and that. Busted rusty ass truck in the background. Am I really small? I feel like I'm uh, like a child. Yeah, like we're not crouched or anything, so I think we're just a midget. Alright, let's have a look. What is this? Thompson, I'm sick and tired of waiting for you to pay your debts. I waited for you to be a man of your word long enough, but it seems people were right about you. I should have listened to your brother and left you starved to death. My own brother? What the f- You are useless, selfish, lazy. I always felt bad for Sarah marrying a bastard like you. Wow. I called my lawyer. We will soon put a lawsuit against- Against you. At least spell it right, you twat. So don't even bother lying to me that you will pay your debts as soon as you have money and blah blah. You can tell your stories in the court. Learn how to spell, you dumbass. How do I put this shit down? It says close, but um, did it bug out? It says close, but there's no way I can, I can uh, go to the couch and take a nap. Don't you have a bed? Bro, like, I beg this shit gets off my screen, man. There's a thing that says close, but I can't go down to it. Uh, this says exit game when I press escape. Hold on, let me let me just spam some buttons and that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, let's just lie down and hope this shit... I'm not picking up another note just because of that. Oh, and we wake up and it's... Um, oh, shit. What is that? What? VTEC. It looks like an old television, but it's like, a, it's like a, some sort of flashlight. I don't know. Unless it's a TV, but there's nothing on it. I must have fallen asleep. I should better go to my room. It explicitly told me to fall asleep on the couch. And why are there rooms in my own house that I can't get into? 
What? Who's knocking at? Or who's knocking my door at this hour of the day? I don't want to find out and become a fucking death stain. But I don't want to read it because it's going to stay on my screen again. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. <sighs> Mr. Dean Thompson. We must inform you that your residence is Clearwater Valley. In Clearwater Valley. Now I'm the one you can't read. Will be demolished by the authorities in two days. What? Can they do that? If you have anything that you want to check and retrieve before the demolition team arrives, please pay a visit to your residence. After the demolition team arrives, you won't be able to enter the house anymore. Well, yeah, because I'm assuming it will be, you know, like the big bad wolf has come through. It'll just be bits and pieces. Kind regards, Matthew Richardson. Well, I'll tell you what, Matthew, you're a fucking asshole, mate. Uh, I should go to the drawer and pick up a flashlight. Is there anyone outside? You just knocked on the door and left a note. Uh, into the drawer. Open the drawer. I can't open them though. And get your flashlight. I mean, I assumed it was a drawer in the bedroom, but maybe it's this one. Yeah, it is. Flashlight. I'm assuming it's F. There we go. Now I can leave the house. All right. Do I have your permission game? Yeah, thank you. Can't really see out there. Oh, it'd be, it'd be nice to throw some darts. Fucking hell, it's dark. It looks like this guy hasn't even unpacked and he's getting thrown out. There's a picture of nothing, okay. Well, let, let's close our bedroom door. And leave the house. You leave your house and drive to your old residence. You quickly tear a... Tear a piece of paper and make a list of the items you remember that may be valuable. Well, I think that needs to be may space be valuable, not may be valuable. It doesn't really make sense. Shit. All right. Um. Well. Um. Semantics aside. Uh, we are here in this creepy place. Why leave the car running, man? Uh, it said press L to check a list. Is it? So ceramic vase, marble bust, brass vase, brass vase, ukulele and antique pocket watch. Who owns, who the fuck owns this stuff? Like who owns, well what one person owns all that? We lived in a cemetery. What the fuck is this? Whoa, what, the, is that just how the stairs sound? That's horrendous. Oh, for God's sake. Sir Thompson, it's been months since you paid a visit to your residence. I have a family to take care of. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to lie. I can't be asked to read all this. I left the keys on the bench. You used to sit with some, some lady or something. Alright, where the fuck is the bench, mate? Oh my God, the bench is in pieces, boy. Okay, different bench. Big ass key. What the fuck? Whoa, 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 what is, what, why, 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 why? All I done was pick up a key, is the key possessed? Was that necessary, developer, man? What the fuck? Jesus Christ. Had me looking around my house in real life. Alright, um, whoa, that is big ass knife, can I not pick that up? I guarantee we'll we'll go out the room, we'll come back, and um, the knife will be gone, and I will become a death stain because someone will kill me with it. Oh, another key. I'm not ready to pick up any more keys. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, I was hoping that noise wouldn't happen again. I got my headphones loud as fuck as well. Oh, that shit actually scared the fuck out of me, man. <sighs> We have these, uh, on these like ghost orbs in the uh, phasmophobia. Speaking of phasmophobia, bro, I'm not ready. Okay, hold on. We only have to pick up four more things, but something tells me it's not going to be that simple. So a bust, va uh, another vase, a ukulele and a pocket watch. Now a pocket watch, I'm assuming. Oh, there it is. I was going to say it must be in some sort of drawer. Okay. Another key. A uh, room key, okay. I'm not gonna lie, it's it's quite unsettling. It's like I'm expecting something to happen. I don't know what or when, 
you know, that's the thing. And I don't know if closing that is a uh, good. Woo! Nope. 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 That's like the number one door you don't open. What in the fuck, bro? Get out of here. Let's get the fuck out of here, man. I'm gone, man. Can we get back in our car, please? Fucking hell. Oh, I'm locked in now. I really don't want to do this, man. Why am I doing this, man? I'm almost... Oh my... What? Who designs a house like this, by the way? Well, we're going in there last. Fucking bullshit. What? Bro, who designed this place? Oh, ukulele. Let's go, let's go. How many more things? We only need three... We only need two more things. That seems a bit too easy. What is that? Who's been staying here and eating fucking baked beans and shit in my room, man? Can't I can't go up here. Oh, wait, I can. Oh, God, do I want to see what's up here in the attic of this creepy-ass place? What is that? Oh, that's a bus. I need to be up here. Give me my bus, bitch. What's going to happen when I find the last item, though? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. She had the uh, heavy metal headbanging going on. What kind of music are you listening to in there, baby girl? What is that on the bed? Is that the last thing I need? That's not a brass vase, is it? Why is the wall vibrating? Wait, where's the ladder I came up on? What the f fuck? Okay, can I, can I fit through here? I'm a midget, so I might be able to. Oh, shit. Is that the vase? Oh my god, I'm what's gonna happen now? That's it, innit? Yeah, look, they've all got ticks. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. It's not gonna be that simple or easy, is it? Uh, leave and go to your car. Guys? Something tells me I'm not gonna be allowed to do that. Go, 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 go. I can't run, I can't run. Fucking open the gate, man. I'm not looking back. What is... Well, maybe I'm looking back. What is this game? You escaped the house with everything you need, but the money was just enough for you to pay your debts. Since then, you feel something also followed you to your home. Was it really worth the risk? And it was that... It was the woman who was listening to the metal in the bedroom. She was all spazzing out and headbanging and shit. Is that a death stain on my window? <laughs> Fucking hell, man. I keep forgetting the door opens like that. Bro, I feel so small in this game. Okay, look, my ukulele's right there. Go and read the letter next to your TV. So we got my ukulele on, on the stand over there. Where's my the other stuff I almost died getting? I can't believe that you paid your debt back. I didn't think you had it in you. However, I don't take back my words. You aren't trustworthy. It's best we don't see and write each other anymore, Dean. I don't know how you found the money, but there must be something dirty behind it. Bro, I just... Oh my god. Uh, hello? So you followed me to the... Back, back to my home, yeah? Uh, do you want to get the fuck out, please? Because I think my soul just left my body. Better yet, can you get in this incinerator looking thing? Since you look like you're made of wax anyway. What do you want? I got the good ending apparently. Thank you for playing. Good ending. And there you have it. Death Stains. The good ending. Where the, the, the woman just comes into your house and stands there. And now you have a roommate. Fuck knows what the bad ending is and... How is there even multiple endings? There's not much you can do in the game. But nonetheless, I liked it. It was a cool little experience. That's the end of this video. Two horror game video. Thank you for joining me. Two short games. I really enjoyed that. Um, as you know, as always, like I said at the start, leave a like, comment and all that. I love you all. I'm going to see you in the next video. All right. Appreciate you in a bit, man.